Alright everybody, this is G.I. Joe and Stuff, Kevin, doing another important toy video. Today, we're going to talk about the Sentinel-1 TH-27 Battleship. Um, it's from True Heroes. True Heroes is really, really kicking it out with real world toys. I hate to call it a toy because <clears throat> they're collector items to me. But it is what it is. But it's still a collector item, toy, slash, any way you want to put it. The thing is really nice. It's big. <clears throat> it holds, I think it's holding on eight or nine figures. I'm going to open it up and show you. I did some stuff on the inside. I seen Dr. Customs. Dr. Customs really, really did some nice stuff to his. Um, as far as the um, making it real world. It has enough real world qualities to me when I look at it. That was one of the main reasons I got it. And of course, you see, I packed it up with some G.I. Joes. The two gunners up front, G.I. Joes. I don't know who these guys are. I got them from Comic-Con out the box. I was very happy to get these Jews because it's hard to get G.I. Jews now loose from people. Let me see if I can turn that around. It's a little dusty. <clears throat> you want to notice as I'm doing these videos, some of my stuff is a little dusty. And the reason is because I got a lot of stuff and I don't take the time off to dust it off. I'm going to say I had this for a good year now. Maybe longer than that. Before Close the Rest closed down. But I'm just giving you a close up on all the detail on it. True Heroes is doing a damn good ooh, ooh, rock the boat job. I loaded it up with plenty of G.I. Joes. I'm going to show you what I did on the inside. I just wanted to show you the details of it. It, it looks like I said real world. They didn't miss a beat. <clears throat> I seen Dr. Customs how he customized his battleship. I did some stuff on the inside. Let me we're gonna talk about the back of it first. I'm gonna talk about that boat, <clears throat> the gun. I put a modern GI Joe in there. I have a, I like to put the modern GI Joes and the old GI Joes together. A lot of guys are stuck on the, putting the modern stuff with the modern stuff and the old stuff with the old stuff. Here's the um, spy plane. They call these the drone planes. This thing is nice. It shoots a bullet. A missile probably. I don't say a bullet. Um, Sentinel-1. It don't say what it is. But we all know it's a spy plane. And it comes with some nice equipment. It came with a nice boat in the back. Loaded, it's loaded with equipment, and like I said, Dr. Giggles. I, I mean, Dr. not Dr. Giggles. Let me cut this music down. Dr. Customs, he's a bad man. What he did with the um, what he did with the um. The battleship was just, you know, out my league. But I still did some stuff on the inside. I'm going to show it to you. But we're going to talk about the little lifeboat that came with it. It came with a light. I don't know if it came with the stop sign. I'll put that in there. Some of the stuff, I, as you can see, I realized I put in there. I put the uh, breathing mask in there. I put the fins in there. I put everything in there. Um, let me just dump it. we just get it over with. I put a shovel in there. I don't know what that is. A walkie-talkie. I think this is a, it's a bomb. Stop sign. I go to something else. I'll get that out of the video. Um, fin. Breathing mask. They go right on the back of the boat, which is hot. I put, like I said, G.I. Joe's in it. I want to take, I got to do some work on him. He's um, an old G.I. Joe. This is Roblox. 
from the Tiger Force. The rubber band in his back is broke. This guy, I, I like this guy here. I don't know <clears throat> exactly who he is. I had him for a while. He's a hot G.I. Joe. I'm not going to say hi. I'm going to find out who he is. Somebody, every time I put these videos out, I'm asking if anybody looking at my videos as actual real G.I. Joe collectors. Tell me if you know who this guy is. I'm going to find out who he is myself. I can look it up. Um, <coughs> just put him over here. And I'm going to show you the inside of this boat. That's why I did that. This battleship anyway. See it is got a console. I put the extra chair in there. That's gun ho sitting in the chair. If you can see if I can get the camera in there. Oh yeah, I got it in there pretty good now. That's gun ho sitting in the chair. That's um the brother, I forgot his name. Next to him. I'm just open it up. Let you look in the inside. Oh. I put all Joe's in there. Put the wrench on in there. I glued that to the side there. I put the binoculars on top of the um, computer, the console. I glued that shotgun up there just, you know, for effect. Now, that console, that console right here, that their um, control panel, I did all of that. I broke that out of an old helicopter. I put the compass in there. I put the laptop in there. I even painted the laptop a little bit. I tried to go for it. Um, that little piece over here. To your... Right here, that's off a little radio. You see the compass? And I put the other chair in there behind the, the driver's chair. <clears throat> Let that focus a little bit. Stop moving. That looks good. You don't have to even tell me it looks good. I know it looks good. I think I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> oh, and I put a map in there. Look at the map on the wall. Can you see that? I did that. Took a little Velcro. Put that map on them. That's true. That come from the True Hero airplane or the submarine. I'm not, wish, not sure which one it come from, but I got it. Not the airplane, the uh, B-51 bomber. Um, <clears throat> I just try to do it the best way I can because it already has so much real world effects in it and on it that I just wanted to put my shot down as far as how it looks and what it does I'm gonna um shoot the guns at you I'll be sitting here and them guns just go off I almost think that uh they did that on purpose you know can you see that I got a good shot of that Bang, that's one. They they pretty they go pretty far too. You gotta take it back over. Oh, it came out anyway. But the guns are no joke. Um This thing is humongous. I'm gonna talk about the light and the radar, I guess. It, can you see that? I'll hold that up a little bit so you can see that. that sound. That's, I guess that's the radar looking for somebody out in the underground. Looking for Cobra. Because I loaded this thing up with GI Joes. Alright. Everybody, this is Kevin. GI Joe and stuff. Talking about True Heroes. TH-358A Battleship This thing is hot No doubt Let me stand the man back up oh, I get everybody landing in right good Top secret I got some top secret Files in there I'm gonna Pause it Yeah, I just wanted to put the men back on it before I close this video out. Um, when I do these videos, I usually like to say thank my mom, thank my wife, thank my beautiful kids, and 
my job and my life. I want to thank everybody, but I also want to give a special shout out to Put It Cobra Commander. He's going through something. <clears throat> he inspired me with these videos. He, everybody go through something. So just get yourself together, man, and be all right. It's not easy to put yourself out here doing videos about toys. Let's be real. But it is fun. It's safe. Everybody, this is um, G.I. Joe and stuff. Kevin, signing off with another important toy video. I love everybody, my wife and my kids. Good night.